It's been a month since the Vatican launched a new Instagram account for Pope Francis. Instagram says he broke a record hitting the million follower mark in just 12 hours. Francis now has 2.3 million followers and 17 million on Twitter. Greg Burke, Deputy Director of the Vatican Press Office, joins us now. Greg, the Vatican's social media is wildly successful. How did you do it? <laughs> well, first of all, I didn't do it. I mean, actually, uh, this started under Benedict uh, with Twitter, and Twitter was already a huge success with Pope Benedict, and I think actually with Francis it just became even more so. Um, it's not the people here, it's the Pope, and it's the draw that this place is, the Vatican. I think uh, that's to take nothing away from an absolutely commanding personality of Pope Francis, and that's added to it. But the fact is... Um, the Vatican draws a lot of people, literally, and it draws a lot of people now on, on the new media as well. So one of the things that you have been able to accomplish when you're there is to get Instagram going and uh, the Pope has the social media. He's very invested in these tweets. How does he approve them? He sees each tweet, which is great, because I think there's an authenticity to that, you know, that the Pope's signing off on the tweets. These are his words. They were his words anyway. Sometimes they're just made a little uh, shorter, or sometimes there are special occasions in which uh, the tweets will be suggested to him. But 90% uh, of them are his, his things from the homilies. Homilies especially, I might say, because that, I think, is where his, where his at his most relaxed uh, and natural, although he tends to be pretty natural all the time, as you can see, as you can see with people. So he signs off on then the photos, of course, on Instagram. Well, you know, the photos are the photos. That's that's who he is. That's what you get. And he signs them with an F, I understand, to say that he gets the stamp of approval. You know, he's a maverick or a master communicator in yeah. many ways. How do you keep up with him? Keeping up with a 79-year-old pope is not always easy because uh, there, are lots, there are lots of surprises. And, and every time people <laughs> ask me, uh, are you sure of this? And I say, well, I'm pretty sure. With, but with the pope, you can never be totally sure. <laughs> well, it sounds like uh, your whole team is doing a great job. Thank you so much for joining us. Greg Berg, Deputy Director of the Vatican Press Office. Thank you.